hello guys you're yeah, welcome to my channel and today's tutorial is we're going to look at converting a stereo track to mono so what we have here is a simple drum groove that i played from a, a drum vst so the groove is very simple and when you look at the, the track you notice that they're in stereo already basically um VSTs are mostly in stereos. So so what we'll do is just convert it to mono. So let's start with the kick kick drum first. Um first thing you do is go to the project window, then go to convert tracks, uh multi-channel to mono. Uh, assuming we have a mono track here, it was this one will be highlighted too, but since we have only stereo tracks, so that's why we have this multi-channel to mono. So you click on it, then this window pops out. So we are converting the stereo, the selected stereo track because we're just converting the kick alone. So assuming we want to convert all the tracks in the project to mono, then we we'll now choose this all multi-channel tracks. So the second one is uh, we have the mute source track. So after conversion, Cubase will automatically mute the other track. Then the, the next one is um, um, the file format. So we're basically going to leave it on this one. So, uh, so having done that, we just click on OK. Then boom, we have our tracks. So what Cubase did is you now it's converted it to mono. So we have now we have two separate tracks. So when you look here, you see this one is panned hard left, and this one is panned hard right. So you can now do whatever you wish to do with it <laughs> so basically for me i have to just bring this one of this track to the center since it's just bass drum and then take out the other one so we have our mono bass drum so if you have to compare the sound if you have to compare the sound now you can see you can hear it. this one is a mono bass drum then this one is a stereo bass drum, so you can spot the difference. Okay, thanks for watching. Subscribe for more.